Welcome back to part two of Big Prize, first mission in the German campaign. And we are here again, and we are ready to assault the village. So, I'm just going to get ready for potential movement in. Getting the officer up here. Got the stern part here, so one there. Start pushing them up a little bit. Yeah. Got infantry here. Just move them a bit forward. Got a kind of what we're going to use as a scout team, basically. Move them forward. Let's get them first, they can be pretty close. So, we're going to move some armour up. We should be in an okay position to push up. We've also got the Panzer IV here, which is going to support. We're also going to get the uh, half track there to uh, overwatch these infantry. Make, and we're going to put them up here actually. Spread them out a little bit, <laughs> and they can kind of watch the middle. We've also got light infantry going in case any Soviet armour tries to push up. Do have some options to you know, actually defend a little bit. Nothing crazy here, but just covers our flank a little bit. We've got some points to spare if we need it. So the mortar's also going to push up there. Could be used if needed for smoke. Get these guys down. We'll slowly start pushing up. The 38T can also start pushing up a little bit. Let's get one on the base, yeah. Good. Infantry squad, just stay where they are. Pans are pushing up a little bit. I forgot what's coming up ahead. So there might be, there's definitely armour in the village and some AT. Don't know if there's any mortars. I can't remember what armour it is, but it's early, so there could be anything from early war T-34s to KV-1s to uh, small light tanks, things like that. So, oh, there's one. So we just pinged it. Stay down, Jesus Christ. Down. Oh my God. <laughs> They're playing basically, um, you know, like musical chairs jumping up and down there. So we've got a tank there, he's just our range. I'm going to use this bridge. Maybe I'll be able to get close enough. So let's, let's double check. Oh, we're just close enough there. That's a hit. That's definitely clipped the front area, probably killed the driver. Uh, we'll have to aim through the fence, see if we can hit it from the side from there. There we go, he's down for the count. Beautiful. Oh, we've got some armour, just saw it ping on the map. So where's he gone? Can't see the silhouette much. Uh, Panzer IV's there, push him up. Oh, that was a big hit. Fire, fire, come on. Why are you not shooting? Track's gone, turn to the front. Oh. Panzer IV should be also engaging. Is in range. Cut. There we go. Oh, that actually landed on the back of the engine panel, so that's it. He's just there. Just push a little bit forward and see if we can get some range on him. Just not getting it. Is that one? Come on guys, we need to try and click this. He's decking some hits now, he's definitely taking a beating. There can't be much left on him. And he's gone. I think his engine's caught fire, let's just double check. Yeah, we've got flames. He might cook off soon. So that's really good. That's good progress. Move the 38T up. Keep this infantry squad pushing up. And this infantry squad's also going to join them. Mortars going to come down here. With the supply truck. Keep that close. I'm waiting to see if that cooks off. There's a lot of fire, there's a lot of explosives in that. It'd be good to see. Come on. Should we see if we can get it? So we can if we can get it to cook off. Just just for fun. <laughs> I'd like to see him explode. One more round, see if we can get it to cook off. No, no cooking off, unfortunately. But he's definitely out of action, which is what I like to see. That squad can go there, they can push up there. 38 is going to cross the river. We've officially crossed the Dnieper. And the mortars are now taking chunks out of our enemies. Oh, get them shooting. It's got some good kills. I'm actually going to get these on open fire, just in case anything tries to come over the lip. Oh, tanks engaging some infantry, turn into high explosive. And the Panzer IV is going to push down here, a bit of backup for him. 
think he's in a good spot there actually for any flank attacks. So this squad's going to push up gradually. Uh, this team actually push up there. Oh. Holy Christ! So I think. Lieutenant, scouts are reporting tank movements towards the village of Glushkovo. Unfortunately, in this weather, the Luftwaffe cannot help you. So enemy armor's coming. A bit scary. Get the Panzer IV there. Reposition him about there. Panzer III is not in a bad spot because we don't know what direction they come from. I imagine the east, but could be northeasterly. I'm going to push the mortar up here so we can get better access to them. Oh, next room to squad. Stern Pioneer as well. I'm going to join down here. So they've got some explosives and anti tank. This squad's going to gradually push up. I wonder if we can actually get a frag from here to there. Let's see if we're getting right to, no, right to the edge. Whoa, whoa, don't do it yet, don't do it yet. No, 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 no. Push there. Ooh, what was that? Oh, we got T. T20s. Eight. Direct it. That is need not engaging. Come on. Wake up. <laughs> Another good hit. He's not down yet. Come on, reload. That's him done. Hatch is open. He's out of action. I think he can chuck grenades from there. That is perfect. Chuck another one. Another tank just got clipped. T26, fantastic. Mortars, get some sandbags out for him. There's enemy infantry coming, I definitely can hear it. What we got there? We've got a T40 coming. I hope they're ready to engage. Hit the engine, he's definitely out for the count. Yeah, so we're absolutely shredding through this armour. Another T26 there. Oh, beautiful. Another hit. Panzer IV just making an absolute mess of these enemies. Gonna take control of this guy. Pop up. There you go, he's down. Holy crap, that just cooked off. A nice little explosion there. Turrets just. Where's the turret gone? I don't even know. Oh, it's there. <laughs> Did some flips. I think that's the enemy armoured push dealt with. They still have some AT guns there. I'm just gonna try and see if we can get a bit of sight on them. Oh, we've got him there. Mortar, time to shine. Let's get some round on him. If we can take them out, we can start pushing around a bit more. This infantry squad's gonna push up this way. Stern Pioneer, just put them gently there. These, these are some G troops. Send them forward. Making a good mess of these though. Oh, I think the mortar just took them out. That's it. So this squad can push up gradually. Nothing too aggressive. Can the mortar reach them? No. But the tanks can actually do that if we switch to high explosives. Let's uh, let's make a mess of these guys. Eh? I like how the Panzer IV F1 just kind of lob it shells, you can kind of lob out the cover. Like that, you can just absolutely demolish infantry, let's try and be sneaky. Ah, I missed. Might, might better fire the truck, see if we get a bit of a splash. Let's do it. There we go, that's a good hit. They're, they're taking losses now. Right, there's another AT gun up there, I think. Something up there, definitely. So the infantry, oh, the infantry did lose a guy, but we've got reinforcements inbound. Whatever's there, the line of sight blocks it, which is nice. We'll try and push up there. The mortar, I'd like to push up into this position up here as well. Start raining down some hell on it. 
Is it got full shells? It's a bit light at the moment though. Just wait there and we'll resupply you quickly. No point sending over half of its shells. Get them down just in case. Get a frag grenade on him. Now I'm going to be a little bit careful. We might advance the infantry up to here maybe. Yeah, we'll push these up. They've got a bit of comfort from the tanks. Don't know what's ahead. Don't want to get too cocky. Oh, he's gone for the account. Brilliant. Where's my medic? Come up and heal. So new three guys there. So new four just ahead. There's that room. So, oh, how much ammo does it? it only carry. Oh, takes a while to rearm it, unfortunately. But um, got time to concentrate on what, what's ahead. The infantry is getting slacked gradually. Right, that, that should be enough. I'm going to push the mortar up here. Oh, what we got? So that's uh, the A6. Nothing too deadly. Hold where you are, guys. Just unbolt it. I'm going to move the 38T up. Try and use these tanks as covers from whatever that is there. Oh, the uh, pullback because whatever's there is actually taking a little bit of a liking to you. It doesn't like you much. <laughs> BA6 is around there somewhere. A little bit out of range there, we'll just hold here. It's got a bit of cover. Is the mortar in position? No, not yet. There's not more infantry there. Another guy there, what's going on here? What's that? Pain in the ass. There's also something popping rounds off that as well, I can't really see. So there's BA6 and there's a 37mm, which is more than enough to defeat our tanks at this point. Because they're so light. So the mortar's going to have to deal with that before we push the BA6. Oh, didums. KV, KV, big lad. Does that have smoke? Get that smoke deployed. You just gradually pull yourself back. Get the stern pioneer down. Get the panzer up. You're not in a bad spot there. Get some hang on your sandbags to use. You keep here. Did it nail that? May have nailed that. Keep it them. Get the high explosive anti tank rounds out. If we can stun this thing, we can make a big difference against it. Oh god. We didn't didn't arc correctly. Come on lads, let's do it. Oh, do we get the tracks? No we did not. Come on, we need those tracks going. Ugh, what do we hit? Oh, we hit the trees. Not good. Need those tracks down, pronto lads. Reload, reload, reload. I think the tracks are gone. Still not. Well, that was a good hit. If we can hit the rear armour again, we might be able to take it out, actually. Oof. Right. Who's got the explosives? Just so I can send... Right, you. You. One, select fire. Just move up slowly. This does have smoke rounds as well. Is it cracks down? No. Get the smoke deployed. There we go. What's actually firing? Is it firing at the The mortar's doing its job, clearing them out. Where is he? He's there, right. Get your explosives ready. Three kilos of it. <sighs> this is risky as hell. Oh, I've done him! Three kilos of explosives straight at the deck of the tank. We'll see if it's enough. Boom, there we go, look at that, it's on fire. Well done, Stern Pioneer, you're getting promoted. You are the hero, you're getting the um, Iron Cross today. Bloody well done. Phenomenal. Oh! Just at the end, it breaks the hull. It's a definite trade, though. A Panzer IV for a KB-1, I'll take that in a day. But it's not out for you, good sir, because you can heal it. He can't, because he's burning to death. Take that, you damn Bolsheviks. Um, now the infantry can push up for the assault. Apart from the med. Get healed up. Get healed up. Can you actually chuck some grenades in there? 
That BA6 needs to be dealt with, so we're going to push this guy up, and he's going to do it. But well done to him. His name is Dietrich Hellman. Hellman. And he's just took that out with the Saturn charge. That is glorious. Well bloody done. The armoured car there, taking a beating. And there we go. He's done for, I think. Yeah, he's, he's out of action. And the AT, the, the um, anti-aircraft gun's been dealt with, so we're now pretty much free reign to push in on this side, I think. But we've got to be a bit careful, just in case. Because we saw what came out, that KB did shock me a little bit. Get the infantry up, get in some positions. Put these guys there, where's the supply truck? It is there. I want you resupplying the mortar because he's done a really good job. And this guy's going to hang around with the mortar. So, we could also do with some Panzer crew, Panzer Wharf. I think they're mechanics by nature. They're in that little car. Oh, my hand's got pins and needles. I think it's from the pure stress of the KV. <laughs> also, rearm some of these tanks. Again, why is he not moving? He's stuck on a tree. That's your typical German driver there. Used to the autobahn, going 500 miles an hour. Can't navigate a tree. Lunatics. Panda 3's been doing well. We're going to push him up here because he's done his job defending the flank. The officer's going to slowly start crawling further up. I think the majority of the village is clear. I'm not too sure. I'm going to chuck some infantry into that house. There is some soldiers over there. We're going to find out when we have a look at this road. Slowly start moving forward. So there's infantry up there, nothing too dangerous. Well, it looks quite clear. That's um, it's happy days for me. At least the AT gun, uh, the anti air gun's gone, there, gone down, which I like. Vehicle repaired, fantastic. We've got Panzerwaff crew, which I believe are all mechanics or similar. The tankmen. Yep, basically tankmen, so this tank will be doing fine. It's got enough ammo for now. Fantastic job. Panzer IV there as well, doing a great job of stunning the tank and keeping it busy. And that smoke shelf, see I love the smoke. That's why, because it's absolutely phenomenal. We're going to move the motor up again. He's got quite a lot of art ammo. We'll push these up with him. And we'll keep this SMG guy just in the back. So I think most of the village is clear. We're just going to push these guys up. He's got one frag, he's going to use it on him. Don't think there's any more reinforcements coming, but you've got to be a bit wary of it. There we go. Has the grenade got him? That should do it. Go there and just start shredding. Oh, there's enemy infantry in these trenches. Oh, steady. There we go. Engage, engage, engage. We're going to have to bring the 38T up here, I think, just to clear out the rest of these trench lines. Stern Pine era. We're going to bring these up over here. The mortar's doing its job. Infantry there. We're going to switch a couple of these guys to the front of that building, get some vision. And the officer's moving up. Not the fastest player, but as you can see, I haven't lost too much either. The Panda 3 can go up here. You can see the carnage we've reaped on the, on the village. And the KV, quite frankly, the best thing that's happened in the match, taking this bad boy out, was... Oh, that's just the cherry on the cake. Cherry on the ice, ice cream there. And it was absolutely phenomenal. Fine display of tactical excellence, soldiers. The village has been neutralized. Thank you very much. And I do agree, it was tactical excellence there by Hartman there with his satchel charge. Absolutely brilliant. Well played to him. He probably saved multiple tanks and infantry's lives because the KB I do actually remember fighting the KB the first time it, I think I destroyed it up here and it took about 20 minutes so really well done now we've got to push up to the fortified positions so this is where the officer comes in slowly crawl them up and see what we've got to deal with we've got Panzer 3 down here Panzer 4 is there he's also going to be needed the mortar you can set up here not going to use the field gun, I'm not a big fan. The armoured car can now push up, cover the flanks. We'll start pushing these guys up here as well. Well, we've got some 
we can call in some more firepower. I think another. I'd like to use different units to be fair. Um, let's have a look. Is there anything else interesting to use, or is it all the same stuff really? Um, we'll bring some more stern pioneer. It's the fun. And we'll bring a different armored vehicle. Let's bring a Panzer Jaeger, just because they look kind of cool. We'll send them up to the village. Double time. This thing actually has got that 4.7 centimeters, but I think it's got better penetration than most of them. So it's, it's high armor. Oh, it can steal the T28 as well. So why don't we get a? Let's get the Panzerwerf crew. Can steal one of those T28s if we can. Might as well make use of uh, what they're not using. There he is, 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 is available. Come straight up here, fella. His rapid little tank. There we go. All the cars there, right. So the officer's slowly moving. Just going to have to wait a little couple of minutes for him to move up. There's definitely infantry and fortifications there. Don't know if anything's up here, but if not, we can easily get stuff behind them and then just start absolutely mutilating them, which is what I like to do. Everything's moving up. Oh, don't crash. <laughs> Jesus Christ. These squads here are not going to cross the front here because, as you can see, there's a trench line there. There's buildings there with fortifications. I think we're better off just completely going round the rear of them. So basically try and cross down here. What I might do, put these on, return fire only. And start pushing these up. And get the tanks ready for an armoured push. Gonna keep the armored car kind of on the road up here, right? So he's he's now found the first units to worry about. I'm gonna keep the officer moving up here. So we've got AT support, uh, anti-tank rifles, so straight away a threat. Panzer is on the move. Get these guys out. And let's get these infantry out. Let's get the rest in. It's not the heaviest tank, but it's kind of cool. And the the. Um, Half track can go sit up there, babysit mortar. And we're also going to bring the stern pioneer up here as well, just to support this push when it happens. If we can sneak this guy on top of the hill, we could be able to see exactly what we've got. Ah, there we go. So we've got a 76mm gun. This is where the mortar might shine again. So we're going to bring the mortar. Where is he gone? How many rounds has he got? He's fully equipped. Bring the mortar to the top of the village. We're going to make use of him. Got the 38T. We do have some more points left, but should be fine. That needs repairing. Let them crack on with that. And the Panzer Jaeger, we're going to bring up here. Get them on fire at will. I'm not seeing. Let's try and push them up more. I'm seeing nothing on this side, which is good. Push these forward. Is that actually blocked by the line of sight? I think it is a little bit. I don't think it's got the range now. We've got something else there. Two heavy guns. That's the job for the mortar. Once they're cleared out, basically, the tanks can just roll in and eliminate the threats. And that's what most of the game is actually just eliminate threats to your tanks. Because once your tanks are cleared to engage, it's game over for whatever comes. So we'll just try and sneak the mortar down here, up to this position. We've got the infantry here in case the infantry push. We'll have them ready to fire. And the officers are going to keep crawling around. Use those binoculars, gents. That's a lot of infantry there. We've got... Yeah, quite well dug in. Yeah. Oh, someone's taking pot shots. But yeah, two... Soviet armored reserves are incoming from the east. What? What is das? Christ almighty. Well, that's triggered summit. T-40, right. Get that tank up there quick. Hold there for now. Oh, sugar nuts. He's got a dushka. Oh, he's hit a tree, you muppet sausage. We are going to lose that squad, I think. Or those infantry units, at least. Where's he gone? Try and engage if you can, can you see? Pump around, pump around, pump around, do it. Right, I'll do it. You absolute pansy. Ugh, the trees are being a pain in the arse, as always. 
Oh, there's quite a few of them. What else they brought? BT7. This ain't going well. Let's see if we can take this guy out. There we go. Where's the Pansy Jaeger? Trundle your butt up there, son. Just get those rounds in. What else did they bring up? BT7, nothing too threatening. You should deal with these threats pretty quick. There we go, that's him done. Come on, finish him off. He's not dead yet. Jesus Christ. BT7 there. Pansy is on its way. DT guns are looking our way, but I think we're out of range, luckily. Oh, he's using his composite rigid. Jesus, well played. Smart tactics. Where's he gone? Lost him. I think he's he, he decrewed himself. Engage him if you can. His track's gone. Oh, we got a pop. And then we got another tank pushing up to the flank here. Well, front of the sort of us, really. I think he's got range on him. Oh, he's done him. That's phenomenal. Get another one in. Keep shooting. We've got a medic here. He's going to move up to engage. Not engage, but to start helping him. He's exploded as well. That Panzer Jaeger doing some solid work there. Um, I want to move the mortar up, but it's a bit risky at the moment. You just stay there while I could fire the mortar. Could actually do moving up. He's still alive somehow. Um, I'm going to take control and go a bit Samo higher on these Russians. Remind them of the Winter War a bit. Oh, let's get down. Yeah, he's he can provide a bit of covering fire, as can Panzer Jaeger. Get him to high explosives. Start laying down some rounds. I'm doing some damage to him now. I love it. That's it. Good work. I think we can. If we can get 38T, I think we can actually sneak it just behind the firing line. Permission to fire, don't do that. Start firing at the AT. Can we get him there without the AT gun spotting him? I think we've done it. And now we're just going to rain fire down on these. Oh, look at the damage coming out. It's just clipped some it. So I was a bit, a bit quiet in some parts of the video. Took a bit of concentration for me. And we can start gradually moving the infantry up. As we... Panzer 3 as well, just get ready for its gun run and the half track. As soon as that AT is down, we are just going to absolutely bolt everything we've got straight at them. It's not down yet, but we're getting there. We've got enough rounds to do the job. 38T made it. That little tank assault they did caught me off guard. Could not remember that bit at all. We need to really deal with these tanks, uh, these AT guns though. Come on, mortar, time to shine. That was a. Was that hit? Almost. How many rounds you got left? Probably not enough. Oh, T26 is still kind of knackered, but we'll bring it up just for the bowls. Where's the supply truck? Kick him up here. You can get him up to the mortar, he can just keep running fire. Keep going! Ugh, the accuracy is very poor. I think I've got to uh, intervene a little bit. I'm very tempted, but I know as soon as I get over that hill I die. Oh, that's the hit we needed. So there we go, that's one down. So we're going to move the first Panzer up, Panzer th move the half track up, move the Panzer 3 up. 
move all the infantry up. Now we're in full assault mode. These guys also push up. They, there's infantry still knocked about. But get these infantry moving up as well. Get the mortar forward up slightly. And all we have to do is take that second AT gun and that'll be it. It's game over for him. Get them all with target him. Should hit the thing by extension. There's the supply truck. I want you to gun it to the mortar. Quick as you can. You feeling brave? Oh, don't be that brave because he's just clipped us. Can you hit him though? Can you hit him from there? Go on, lad. Oh, and there we go. Full assault. They've got no AT, I don't think. We're going for it. Push, push, push. Let's get over it. Let's do this. All units. Move in and engage targets at will. This is the thing we've been waiting for. I'm going to leave that on there just in case there's any more armor coming. And as you can see, absolute demolishing. Just shredding targets. There is a maximum over there, but that's what the 38T is for. You can deal with some of them. Push up. Just kill, kill, kill. Are we getting shot by some AT, maybe? Or that might be the mortar just shooting rounds bloody everywhere like a lunatic. They might have a mortar actually, to be fair. Didn't think of that. But we've got... Yeah, they've got more of that. Let's get shooting. Mm -hmm. Just spraying down everything that lives. There you go, that's the infantry gun. Oop. There's a commander. Get him shot. There you go, he's dead. And we're just pushing up here while the rest of the tank clear that up. Oh, I can't. Molotov's not going for a bit of a, bit of a run. Ah, there we go. Hello, good sir. And there we go, cleaned out. Oh! Hello, good sir. Did not see you hiding in the tree line there. Do we not have any anti-tank rounds left? Oh, he's done it. Oh! Someone hit him! Bloody good shot, old chap. Well done. Phenomenal kill. Did not expect that just there. Half-track's pushing up with his swords. Inventory, time to put Krieg up. Get on foot and push in. Pushing, pushing, pushing. Has he actually tried to recruit the mortar? Did he lunatic? Oh, there was dual mortars, that's what I didn't realise. I think the Maxim's in the building. I'm going to find out and drive through this another bitch. Oh, fortunate for you, gents. It's not going to end well. Ah, we've got him. That's what you get. We're behind their line now. Just watch him spray him down. Get the infantry in the trench. And that's it. That's basically them done. I think that's all we need to take out. Push this guy in the whip. And that to me looks like a successful assault. They're almost all dead. Push the infantry up. We're literally going full. Excellent job, full. soldier. There we go. This Throw elevated it. position will no longer be a threat when the weather clears up. I think that's it. Secret objective, I imagine, is the middle bit, maybe, to take. Oh, I'm guessing there's something to steal there. And that's it, guys. After Gluskova, the attack on Vyazma seceded and the Germans marched towards Moscow. However, because of the extreme cold and large scale Soviet counter-offensive, counter -offensive, the attack on the Russian capital was no longer on the cards. Little were they to know they would have to fight over the same place just a few months later. So there we are, and we lost 259 men and 23 vehicles, and we lost 18 in one vehicle. So a successful mission. I think it went quite well. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, leave a comment um, if you've got anything to say about how you guys do it. I might have to approach it from a different way next time, and um, I'll see you on the next video.